Hi, this is Dr. Earl with Solix. I'm excited to talk to you today about the powerful technology and science behind the AOScan Mobile. Now, if you will indulge me for just a second, let me introduce myself for those of you who don't know me. I practiced emergency medicine for 16 years and it was amazing because I got to see everything that medicine encompasses from pregnant moms, newborn babies, all the way up to geriatrics where we saw strokes and heart attacks neurosurgery, the neurosciences, etc. And it was amazing. Well, I ended up getting sick and frankly, Western medicine didn't have an answer for me. So I started looking elsewhere and came across amazing, true science that absolutely changes the game as far as health and medicine is concerned. And one of those is the AOScan Mobile in Solex. Well, I've formed several companies that have helped move medicine hopefully forward in a very powerful way. But I'm super excited about, about Solex and what we, the, the technology and the, the amazing science behind it. Now, in a previous um, video, I talked briefly about the basic physics, the core science that really makes it so that the AOScan Mobile can read what's going on in your body. And if you'd like a little more information, I'll refer you to that. But just briefly, would you bear with me while I do a quick review? So, if we apply all of the agencies, all of the things that medicine involves, then we need to start looking outside of pharmaceuticals and surgeries. And the reality is, if you look at atoms and what makes up the core basis of life as we know it, there is a nucleus in the center, there are electrons outside, and then everything else in between is energy. And some will say empty space, but the reality is, when we really go about measuring that, they are energy and energy levels. Well, again, taking the atom and breaking it down, that means we are 2% solid, 2%. Well, that also means then that we are 98% energy. So if you start thinking about energy um, and the impact it has in our lives, it becomes amazing and powerful. It's the other 98% of what makes up life as we know it. And again, this isn't just me saying this, this is core basic science. Well, because of that, Tesla referred to the, the understanding of the universe as having an understand of energy, vibration, and frequency. And he later added resonance. So energy, frequency, vibration, and resonance. Well, let's talk briefly about each of those. So there's a lot of different types of energy. There's everything from thermal energy, sound waves, um, and the list goes on and on. And you can see the list there. There's um, infrared and, and again, amazing different types of energy. Well, everything has an energy um, frequency. Everything has an energy signature would be the better way to put it. Because at the core, they found that again, this goes all the way down to the atom. Frequencies has to do with how that energy is expressed and how it comes out. And it is really amplitude over time. Now, that may not mean much to you, but it means a lot to us when we start to measure that energy. And lastly, energy has a, a, a frequency and a vibration so that when energy is applied to certain substances, it gives off a very specific vibration because of the makeup. And a perfect example of this is the tuning fork. No matter what you strike a tuning fork against, it will give off a signature vibration and sound. And that sound comes with an energy, a frequency, and a vibration. Well, when you start asking again and referring again to the atom, that this goes all the way down to the core of life, atoms have a very specific energy. They have a very specific frequency. And did you know they also have a very specific vibration? Scientists just recently discovered that atoms actually give off a sound. That's amazing. And so everything has a signature energy, frequency, and vibration. And that's how we can measure what's going on inside of your body and compare it to normal. So atoms become molecules, molecules become cells, cells become tissues, tissues to organs, organs or systems, organs and organisms, and away we go, and that's, that's all of us. Each with our own separate energy, frequency, and vibration. Well, in medicine, we've been using energy, frequency, and vibration for years. This is an EKG, and it actually shows a different frequency and vibration and an energy signal that we use to read how the heart is performing. We've done this for decades. Additionally, we have magnetic resonance 
imagery, MRIs. We, we actually, now MRIs are amazing technology because we actually use a strong magnet to change the polarity of the cell and then by pinging radio waves off it, we can tell what the resonance of that tissue is and then convert that into an image. Amazing. So, just a quick review. Everything has a signature blueprint, a signature energy frequency and vibration, and everything can be measured quantified and compared against the normal. And that's what we do with the AOScan Mobile when we read what's going on or scan our bodies. Well, let's talk a little bit now about how we balance things out and what happens there, because we're gonna discuss what happens with resonance. Now, if you look at this, it says, resonance describes the phenomenon of increased amplitude that occurs when the frequency of a, a periodically amplified force is applied, is equal or close to, excuse me, is equal or cl close to a natural frequency of the system on which it acts. Now, that's hard for E even to say. So what does it really mean? It means that tuning fork A, if it's going, if it's giving off its standard energy frequency and vibration, is close enough to impact um, tuning fork B that tuning fork B will actually start to sing the way that tuning fork A is. So it has an impact. That's amazing. Well, we know this to be the case because we can actually stack waveforms by putting waveform A and waveform B together to make waveform C and amplify those waveforms and add them together. And this is actually what happens when a soprano sings at a certain octave. She actually sings in such a frequency and with such force that as the sound goes around the glass, eventually it builds and builds and builds and adds on top of itself until the glass shatters. Did you know we can also do the opposite? We can take two energy signatures and give the, the opposite signature and then cancel them out. And this is what noise canceling headphones are all about. It's amazing technology because it has energy, frequency, and vibration. And now we're using resonance, which is the power of that energy, frequency, and vibration to either augment or delete the other waveform. So let's go back to the MRI because we know in an MRI that different tissues will respond to different resonance. That's the power of an MRI. So it takes those cells, polarizes them, and then pings radio waves off them. And based on the resonance, based on the, um, the, the near ping, if you will, the near energy that that tissue gives back, tells us what to put on the image for the MRI. We even use um, resonance in something called a gamma knife. So a gamma knife allows us to do procedures or to affect, affect tissues with radiation and other energy sequences and, it, and a deep level inside the brain or other tissues where it would be absolutely dangerous for us to perform that surgery. But by putting different waves at different locations and then having them coincide at a location very specific to the gamma knife, it produces resonance increased frequency, and it actually works as a knife to help destroy that tissue that we don't want. Amazing technology. So again, medicine is already using what we have in the AOScan Mobile. This is just logic, physics, science applied in a brand new exciting way. Now wait a second. Everything has energy, frequency, and, and vibration that can be measured and then it can be influenced by resonance. Is that, what, that, is that what we're saying? Yes, that's what we're saying. And so when we start taking the, um, the AOScan mobile and we start balancing things out, that's what we're doing is we are reading what your body has going on inside. We're comparing it to normal. And then we use a like frequency to try to move that energy back towards normal. Amazing. So, it's, it's no more complicated, it's no more simple, it's no more complex, it's no more amazing than just that. We measure it, we compare it to normal, and then we use that resonance to pull things back towards normal. Now, some patients and people ask, 
why don't we just bring it all the way back to normal? Well, we found through, again, the scientists that did, did extensive research on this from every from the United States, Germany, Russia, Italy, and the list goes on, they found that if we push the tissues too fast back to normal instantly, the tissues actually can reject it and it can actually cause damage. And so what you'll find is as you use your AO scan mobile, you may not come back to normal each and every time that fast. And that is a benefit. And that proves the scientific validity of what we're doing here because we've gone deep enough to look at what makes a difference. And we want to pull you back gradually over time. That's why it's important to use your scan, AO scan mobile frequently and appropriately. This slide talks about life being redefined and that you're 99.999% empty space. But I want to actually focus on the fact that that's not the reality. The reality is we are 99.99 or 98%. And again, that just depends upon who's doing the measuring and the science. It's a pretty um, insignificant difference. We are that amount of energy. So AO scan mobile, Solex, true science, logically applied.